So this video is going to be about hard wiring accessories instead of using this uh, 12 volt cigarette lighter adapter that comes with them we're going to be getting power directly from the MBEC which as far as I can tell stands for mid bust electrical connector which is this thing right here uh, we're going to unscrew this and I'll show you what's inside of it okay Inside we got a whole bunch of pins. Uh, I'm guessing several of these are used for accessories uh, that, or options that come with the truck that I don't have. I've just got a pretty basic work truck so a lot of these aren't being used. Okay, across the top of this thing there are five different ports. We're looking at number one, which you can see has six pins in it. And I've drawn those six pins of port number one right here and we're going to be plugging into the one that gives us 12 volts when we turn the key as well as the ground so just like on the drawing we stuck our red lead our hot in the top right and our black ground lead in the bottom right sticking the key in We got 12. Turning the key off. Back down to nothing. Alright, now it's time to get rid of this thing and strip the wires. So we're going to be using these uh, little connectors to go right onto those pins. Uh, they're the smaller size ones, not the regular quarter inch size ones. I got these at auto parts store. You can probably look up the part number if you're looking for them. Uh, you can buy GM six pin connector clips that go and plug right into right into that thing and have like a pigtail coming off of it where you splice the wires. But those are 30 bucks. So really up to you. This only costs a few bucks. Put some heat shrink tubing on there and I'm about to attach those connectors. Alright, got those all heat shrink and taped up and connected and crimped. Uh, the white wire is this one. Let's stick them on there and see what happens. We got our new wires plugged in there. Put the white to the hot and the black wire to the ground. And it's time to test it out. This is a dash cam I have set up behind the rear view mirror uh, that's plugged into what we just did. I'm about to turn the keys and hopefully this thing kicks on. Hey, there we go. Lights right up. Uh, I have it just how we wanted it. When we turn the keys, it's powered on. When we turn the keys off, it powers off. There are ways to set it up where you can have that constantly on if that's something you're interested in but this video is for accessories that you want to turn off when you turn off the car